Milky Monday. Moo! So, we just came out of the fucking movie theater. And we were seeing A Star Is Born because, you know, the Golden Globes are tonight. And I have never seen it. So Nick has seen it. And I heard this ending was so good. Oh my gosh. Right before she like goes to the Grammys, the fucking lights turn on and the movie stops. So then we were expecting, oh, we're just gonna like, you know, turn back on. That's like 10 minutes later and nothing's happening and the emergency lights are on. This girl walks in and she goes, evacuate and leaves. Are you gonna tell us what's going on? It took until someone came back from the bathroom and said, yeah, there's a blackout. We're gonna have to evacuate. So, I got my free fucking movie pass, but I'm not gonna be seeing A Star Is Born because they just put it back in the theaters just for the Golden Globes. Totally not worth my fucking money. Well, no, it's his money. The whole eight dollars. The whole fucking eight dollars. The movie was dragging out so long. And then I finally got to like near the end and this bullshit happens. And look at the Irish fucking bullshit. <laughs> All right, new update. We are now driving over to Nick's house, and I'm thinking about Bohemian Rhapsody would fucking never. Center Valley would never. And like, I was sitting there and I was like, should I run some improv on there? Like, get everyone else out of their seats and shit? And then I was like, I know y'all came here to see A Star Is Born, but like, I'm about to give you some Bohemian Rhapsody. But honey, A Star Is Born, and her name is Jordan. Her name is Jordan Taylor. Yeah. After Roger Taylor. I'm kidding, that's my middle name. Today's been a day, and then there's been a fucking accident. Middle of the road, right as we're trying to evacuate. So, yeah, today's been a day, man. Today's been a day. We ate some popcorn. Gross. <laughs> We feel so unfulfilled right now. And I just wanted to see the movie. I, I really did. No, no. I, do, I just, I... We should sue. What? Do you want to sue? sue? Sue for what? We're white enough. Yeah, you're we can right. sue. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, I told my public speaking class, I was like, oh my god, because we had the freaking lock-in and I didn't get to eat my lunch. Oh my god. I should be able to I should be able to sue. My mom's white enough. And then all the Hispanics in the in the classroom, I think almost like like literally laughed so hard they almost <laughs> pissed themselves. Welcome to comedy, guys. <laughs> um we're gonna go home and watch Bird Box because we need to watch a movie that will make us feel fulfilled. Also, did you guys know that the one guy in Bird Box who went like insane and started pulling down the newspapers? He was Miami in Bohemian Rhapsody. I'm obsessed. Nick punched me. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> I didn't mean for you to actually do it. It's happening, girl. Ow! <laughs> oh, it's like it's that one that stings because your knuckles are so like <laughs> pronounced. <laughs> you have like nothing in your fingers, so I just straight up knuckle. Anyway, thank you for coming to my TED talk. This has been the Moo. And thank you.